Lena Landsberg and Penny Kianzad in the Bantamweight division. Penny Kianzad coming off a loss to veteran Raquel Pennington by unanimous decision, beating veteran Alexis Davis, uh, veteran Sajara Eubanks, veteran Bejko Adeda, uh, and then Jessica Rose Karku, I would say sort of is a veteran in this Bantamweight division. She's fighting another uh, veteran type of girl. I mean, even though Penny Kianzad has more uh, more wins uh, and more losses, just the overall more experience than and Lena Landsberg. Lena Landsberg has definitely fought the better competition. I mean, Chris Cyborg uh, was her UFC debut right there. She fought Aspen Ladd, Iana Kuniskaya, Macy Chiasson, and then Sarah McMahon. I think this should be a decent fight here. Um, I mean, the grappling, the wrestling, Lena Landsberg is pretty decent. That would be the way she's going to win here, but when was the last time she fought? That last loss uh, to Sarah McMahon was 2020, about what, two years and three months ago. It's been a while since we've seen a Lena Landsberg fight. So, uh, with the unpredictability of Lena Landsberg, I really have no idea how she's going to come in a two-year layoff from a professional MMA fighting. I'm going to lean Penny Kianz out. I think she outstrikes her for three rounds. But, you know, I I've seen a lot of these veterans come back after a long layoff and just look surprisingly very good. Um, so, you never know with Lena Landsberg, but yeah, I'm going to go towards a Penny Kianz to win that fight.